All right, so I'm back. Uh, if I'm talking low, it's because I just got off work. It's about 11.45. Just got out the shower and everything. And my wife and the kids are asleep. So I got to kind of be quiet. Um, anyways, so I just got out the work. One of the things that's... Um, the, one of the problems that I have when I uh, when I get off of work is winding down. So uh, one of the things I like to do is drink uh, a certain kind of tea, and that is lavender tea. Now I do have loose leaf uh, lavender uh, flowers, dried lavender flowers, but I've had this one for a while, and it doesn't expire until February 2024. So. I think you can see it on here somewhere maybe no it's not on here but it is on the box but uh, as you can see it's not just uh, chamomile and lavender in here um, this is by Bigelow uh, Bigelow uh, and so it says uh, chamomile wild orange leaves passion flower lavender red poppy flowers uh, natural lavender and rose flavors um, so I'm gonna make this tea. I uh, got my tea kettle out ready. Got my cup that I'm gonna use. Um, so at nighttime or anytime I'm at home, I just use a regular tea cup or whatever you want to call this. So we go ahead and get started. Again, whatever cup I'm gonna drink out of, I always use that cup for the water to put the water in, so that I don't under or overfill. Into the tea kettle we go. Then this goes on the platform to. Now this tea kettle it does have a infuser that goes on the bottom of this little thing right here. So you can put loose leaf tea in here. Uh, and this slides on there and then it goes down into the tea kettle just like that and but the only problem with that is you have to put enough water in order for it to catch the loose leaf and um, steep so um, I'm just gonna boil this and just do the regular uh, steeping method inside the cup So the blue light is off. Now I'm just going to pour the water. Now with this tea, um, it does have a four minute steep time. As it says right here so anytime like I said when I do the tea bags I always go by the uh, instructions on the tea bag so we're gonna set the four minute timer um, and anytime I do a steeping like this I always um, I always cover it up so I'll cover it up with a plate to kind of keep the circulation of the steam going so while that's steeping, I kind of want to go over some things that um, lavender itself is good for. Um, now, this disclaimer, these are not things that are meant to cure anything. Um, always check with your physician before you try any type of uh, herbal uh, supplementation for uh, medicine. Um, these is not to diagnose anything. These are just things that I've researched um, and found out. Uh, for my personal use um, and I just uh, share them with so some of the benefits of lavender uh, says that it helps fight insomnia decreases anxiety improves skin quality uh, treats migraines protects against fungal infections pain management respiratory health rich in antioxidants ease uh, symptoms of diabetes uh, urological support and that uh, is for um, uh, lavender oil 
So you can make lavender oil. Like I said, I do have loose leaf um, lavender uh, flowers, dried lavender flowers um, that I make tea with. But I've had that tea box for a while. A lot of the teas that you'll find because they're dry, um, as long as you keep them in a cool place, they'll last a long time. And so um, uh, you'll find that they have a really, really uh, long shelf life. Okay, so it's been four minutes and the tea is done steeping. Um, with the lavender tea, I, I noticed a lot of times uh, you can't really tell in this blue cup, but sometimes it'll have a purplish, greenish tint. Um, I know a lot of teas do have that brown tint to them, and then some are kind of clear. Uh, some that I'll do later on, uh, like my uh, hops and lavender tea, a lot of those uh, loose leaf teas. Uh, they do uh, tend to be clear but the steep is going to be the same one of the things I found that it, is if you want a stronger steep always add either more tea bags or add more loose leaf to it uh, instead of steeping it longer because like I told, uh, said uh, once before you can over steep and you can under steep your tea um, so um, now, uh, I do like to sweeten my tea, but instead I don't use sugar, uh, instead I use, uh, this, uh, this is Madhava, uh, organic light agave, it's 100% blue agave, um, I also use honey, uh, sometimes, but, um, I prefer this better because I don't have to use as much, and, uh, it gives it a nice, uh, nice, uh, sweet flavor without being overpowering, overpowering like sweet if that's a word but anyways so i'm gonna fix this up and try to relax and get some rest for in the morning until then leaf life